Hello, I'm Ian from Impact Off-Road and here we are again with one of our amazing little Impact Quad Trucks. This one is Daihatsu High Jet and it's a jumbo, which means it's huge. Well, in a manner of speaking, in comparison to one of our other trucks. So you'll immediately see from the uh, front, we've actually got LED fog lights, LED headlights, which is a um, standard specification for 2020, 2021 and 2022. Um, vehicles. Um, you'll also see some interesting little sensors up here and it's really really good. We have a farmer who has actually told us that the frontal collision alert does actually work when he's driving behind his cows along his race. So maybe a silly idea for a farm but you never know. Uh, lane departure warning doesn't work on the farm, I'm sorry, no white lines. But hey, you win some you lose some. Coming into the vehicle here, one of the things that people don't actually realize about our vehicles is this fuel safety rating. They're 5.3, so they have an incredibly fuel efficient engine um, in comparison to any of the other farm implement vehicles. Um, and also, they have a VSR R 5 star safety rating. So yes, there's NCAP, there's three safety ratings that the New Zealand government go by on their website, so have a look and you'll see what the VSR R safety rating is. But when I say this vehicle is huge, for us it is. It's got individual bucket seats which have a lower bucket in them. So even if you're over six foot five, like you know, taller than our salesman can, um, he fits into this absolute bottle. He sort of hits the roof in our standard vehicles. But in here it's a piece of cake for him. Um, your seats recline back and look at all that space in the back. You've got about an excellent 300 mils of space in there to I don't know, we've had uh, clients buy these as babysitters, they have the car seat in here, keep them nice and warm and cosy at 4 o'clock in the morning when they're dealing with the herds, and guess what, all the baby gear's in the back. So whatever you want to use it for, hunting, keeping your rifle safe, um, keeping tools, all of that sort of gear safe um, and out of the weather, this is the vehicle for you. central locking so if you're just wanting it to be in town car and running around and just used as a mobile trailer or even just getting to work and back as we're getting more and more people do it does have that so we can lock and we can unlock the car with this wonderful key so why not all five speed manual this one even has electric windows everything that you need on a farm you know electric windows we'll do that again look at that up and down Woo! So the jumbo cab comes standard with that. Um, we do have another model of standard, which is an extra, and that comes with that as well. Um, but through the middle, we've got our classic four-wheel drive. So it's four-wheel drive, two-wheel drive. It has dip lock and first and reverse, high-low ratio. So this is a pretty formidable vehicle off-road, and this is our vehicle of choice for modifying um, because it's very, very easy for us to do the modifications and to get this vehicle into, into an off-road kit. Um, Part of that off-road kit that we can fit to these is these big wide 11 inch quad trucker. Quad trucker, it's our own rim, it's our own tire. Um, they're 11 inch wide and they go on the back here and on the front we do an 8.5 uh, on the front. Um, and these come in either 22 or 23s for the Daihatsus we, we recommend the 23 inch. Um, it's a harder heavy duty rubber and we'll fit on this. Um, on our older motors like the Suzuki um, we have to put our 22 inch on there. Your other options is we can do some bling. Bling bling. Everyone likes bling. So we have options. The one can have a bag. That's as good. Here we go. So we can put alloys on there with a pretty cool looking road fire. Or as it's lights right now, we can black back it. So there you go. Whatever you want. These are all road legal, these tires and wheels. However, these ones are an ATV tire and there's no road legal ATV tire in the market at this stage. So coming around the back, you'll notice a little bit of a difference with the train, with the jumper. Yes, you can still fit a fence post in. 
but it's through the middle. You do lose 300 mils of your upper tray depth. So we, fitting our stock rates, we can still do that, um, but you would need to drop the tray to fit our stock crate in the rear tailgate. You move the rubber mat back so that your cars don't fall through the gap there and you can still have that low capacity and that high low capacity with our stock crate. Um, the other thing too is it's quite a good place to be able to fit a door and again secure items if you need to secure items in there. Tools, chainsaws, whatever you want out of sight, out of mind. Other than that, the vehicle is a 2020 Hijet. They're incredibly comfortable. It's road. This can be made road legal. They'll do 100 kilometers an hour. Um, and they have ABS, they have traction control, they have vehicle stability control, um, power steering, air conditioning, so a lot of the creature comforts that probably a lot of people don't realize actually are in these vehicles. So we have a lot of fun with them. Hey, why don't you? Come and have a chat to us.